Hi, I'm Nina. So I am from the Philippines, from the southern part of the Philippines, a city called Davao. I came here in China during um, the Advanced Field Ecology course um, in 2016. Since you know how Exhibition is very far from the city, most of the people here are actually quite close, the, most of the, the foreigners. We have um, a 10 o'clock coffee break. Then in the coffee break, you can also like tell your frustrations to the people or you can tell what your problems are, like, especially for us foreigners that we're away from our family. It's nice that um, we have other family aside from our own family. Also, money is like a big deal when you like you need a lot of money to conduct a field expedition, to conduct any research. But in China, it's um the funding is um open like a lot of you can you can you can get the funding so you can do the research that you wanted, and then you can experience things that um um like you can go for a conference abroad. Because it is supported by by the, the the Chinese government, so it's it's really we're really thankful about that about that one. When I did my PhD, I shifted into a different um, study now. So I'm doing um, the evolution of um, skull morphology, more of um, trait trait evolution, trait ecology, um, but still related to wildlife. I don't think most people understand. The extinction of one species, what would be the effect? So you you see, um, climate change has always been an issue since before. But before the change is natural, like the mammoths were gone, the dinosaurs are gone because of change in the climate. And it's not just the change in the climate that attributes to that one, but also because they don't have anything to feed on. And if our food that comes, that will, um, uh, depends on the environment will die, then we will also die. So that's what, not just me, and I think most of the ecologists want people to understand. That's why we're doing conservation works and ecological work, because you need the science to do conservation. One home, shared future.